so when I first came to the clinic, I came because I had a, I had a, uh, shoot, I've had back problems for, I don't know how many years, uh, while playing uh, in the NFL. I started probably around 07 and last to this day. Um, but no, I came in to address that. Um, you know, it was just a lot of pain, a lot of, um, you know, frustration from being so active and then having to kind of slow it down uh, because of my back and wanted to find a solution for it, which is what brought me in. I went all the way to surgery, um, trying to, you know, fix my back problems. And so, I mean, probably leading up to coming in here, I had just had a uh, back surgery, which didn't do much. Um, I, I thought it would. I thought that would, you know, solve the problem, and I could get back to just being, you know, the young spry guy that I that I was. And I'd always been aware of alternative or whatever, like uh, Eastern, you know, medicine and and what that brought to the table that was different from traditional medicine. Um, just you know, being an NFL athlete, we're around a lot of different people, doctors that, that they throw all kind of stuff, you know, at you. Um, and so uh, from that realm, I had a, a friend of mine uh, introduce me to uh, Dr. Reardon's um, practice and, and what they did with stem cells. And, you know, here being presented that I didn't, I had no idea the power and what Dr. Newland brought to the table. Um, I mean, and I can say like this has like really changed my life just in regards to just daily movement, like getting up and going about my day. Um, and so I consistently get dry needling because I know what it does for my body. My body responds really well to it. Um, and now I'm, I'm used to it. I have a routine. Um, and I don't, I don't even know how many <laughs> sessions I've had now, but uh, a lot and you know, I don't see that changing anytime soon. You know, prior to prior to trying the stem cells, um, a lot of the you know the surgeries, the cortisone, the physical therapy, um, it, uh, chiropractic work, all you know, the massages, all that stuff would still leave me uh, to the point where there was times where I couldn't even just stand up. Uh, my stand would be like kind of a hunched over and I couldn't take a normal step. I had to take a small step because if I went too far outside of my frame, it was like uh, everything would just kind of collapse, like shut down and it would send me to the ground. And so I was uh, for pretty much consistently having moments like that that would happen, uh, you know, every month, a couple months, you know, but it wasn't gone. There was never um, six months where I could just be and not worry about it. Um, certainly not a year. Um, and so, you know, off, after all of that, coming here and having kind of my first um, session, um, you know, immediately I felt, you know, some relief. It wasn't until I realized, man, this is really good, um, till when I had a solid three, four months, three and four months where it was just okay. Like, I could just, I could just be, I can do life, I can just kind of move, I can, you know, get in and out of the car. I can get up out of the bed uh, in the mornings. That, that's huge. Like, in the mornings, getting out of bed is, is ridic painfully slow, and, and it, you know, it's just a, it's a, it's a hassle. Like, it, it take time, and I'm, you know, this is 38. This is mid-30s for me, and getting out of the bed is painfully slow, and I can't just get up and go. Um, and so to be able to kind of wake up and just, you know, sit up and stand up and then not be like a, a hunched over stand holding my, you know, my legs and then getting that first step down and the next one and then just using the wall to push myself back up and I, like to not have to, you know, really do that um, consistently was relief. The staff here is like, uh, it's like my extended family <laughs> now. Um, I mean, between, you know, coming in and I know I'm, I'm probably one of the, the more troubled children that they deal with, uh, with scheduling. It's like, oh, oh, can we do this time? Oh, no, I can't go that time. Can we do this time? Um, they're just, 
so patient and um, generous uh, with being open to and, and flexible to you know the times. And then when I come, like it's it's sweet. Like uh, I mean, it, it really is like like family. We we talk and we know a little bit about you know each other's backgrounds and and lives. And it's just it's a great it's a great atmosphere to be a part of. Regardless of whatever else there is out there, like I'll be here and I trust Doc and I trust I trust what 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 um, the practice offers. Therefore, this is going to be for me. like I'll, I'll I'll always be here. <laughs> so I'm doing something.